Auntie? Oh, why, whatever's the matter? Uh, I'm big sick, that's what's the matter. What sort of life have I got? Washing the clothes of a lot of low-down, dirty, common criminals. I've given the best years of my life to that prison, and what have I got to show for it? I'm still an attractive woman. If only I had a bit of money, I, I could spruce myself up, get me a nice fella who'd look after me, shower gifts on me, but, but no. I've got the prisoners washing to do, day in and day out. I've got nothing to look forward to but the grave. <laughs> well, that's what I've come to see you about, Auntie. You know that new prisoner we've got, Mr Toad? <laughs> Not that notorious criminal. Well, yes, he did do wrong, cheeking policemen. But he's not like the others. He's a gentleman. And what's more, he's rich. You're not expecting me to marry a toad, are you? I do have some standards. No, 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 nothing like that. But since he's been in my dad's prison, I've got to know him. And I feel sorry for him, and I want to help him escape. Now, you walk in and out of the prison all the time, and no one takes any notice of you. If you were to come to his cell and swap clothes with him, he could walk out free. What? Take my clothes off? He'll pay very handsomely. Oh, I don't know. I'm not taking my knickers off. A lady has to preserve her modesty. You wouldn't have to do that, and afterwards we could make it look like he'd overpowered you. He'd pay you, I don't know, a hundred pounds? A hundred pounds? I'd have to think about it. I'll do it when. Everything's quiet in the prison. All the guards are having their afternoon nap. It's the perfect time. Come what? on! No, what, 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 I'm not taking my knickers off. Thank you.